won school principal prizes or smitten joined them for the celebration today at the children's and what is she placed an order that i should speak on early childhood and parenting and health <laughs> I think I'm not a psychologist, but then I thought it's a good opportunity to tell the basics of what we have been training in that school. Early childhood and parenting. In our school, or with the parents, there are three stages very, very important for the parents to practice. When parents practice, you don't have to teach the children because the children follow us. They don't even follow us, they just melt with what you are. Because understanding the sound, the language, the flow. I went and asked, Miso no Gishmas. And they said, ah, no, no, Miso, Miso. Oh, you got to flow with the sound. And the parents should immediately tell the child to what language. So we start with, Sumimo say, Gomana Sai and Arigato Gozana. That means, excuse me, I am sorry, thank you. When the, when the child is reading a book, or the father is reading a newspaper, or the mother reading a newspaper, the father do not flick it out from the mother. He will say, excuse me, Sumimo say, and he said, Gomana Sai. I'm sorry, can I have the newspaper? Can I have a plate? So the child is watching. And the child uh, tries to flick it up, you'll say, no, 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 you should say, excuse me. Excuse me is very, very important. If you do not do that basic foundation of expressing excuse me, Japan has become one of the economic might. But other countries are trying to overtake them. What the use of overtaking? Because it grows like mushrooms and fall down like mushrooms if your Sanskrit, if your culture is wrong. So practicing these three is very important in every stages of your life. Excuse me, I am sorry. So don't bother about here to say sorry. You have to take them even to the court. That sorry is a way of life. A hundred thousand times of sorry, yes. Arigato gozai means thank you, thank you. It reflects, because when you say thank you, you have understood the value of what you got from them. They have given you a part ah, with the love and affection. When they have given you a part or they have given you the food or they have given you a book, you understood what kind of hard labor they had gone through to buy one fruit or a book, and when the book is given to you, and when you say Harigato Gosaimas, and they accept that Harigato Gosaimas, means they have become your protector, yes, of this one. So it becomes a real powerful melting the parent and the child continuously. The sound, instead of telling, mm, 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 making actions, no, no, you should express. In that expression, you find out a lot of psychological defects can be corrected. Yes. The another one thing we go is Whenever the husband goes, the father goes out, keep the child next to the next to you. The mom can say, Kyoskatine means take care. Gumbatta Kodasa means whatever work you are going ahead, go ahead. But never turn back to look means never get frightened because Kyoskatini is there. Take care means I am also standing here as a security. You also go to do a particular job with security thinking. Your culture is always there. What is your culture that you say Kyoskatini, take care, Gumbatta Kodasa, go ahead, but never turn back, get the work done. You are having three security guards, Army, Navy, and the Army, Navy, and the Air Force. Three security guards. Those three security guards are the excuse me, I am sorry, thank you very much. If you have these three, 
when you go ahead, everybody will see your heart. It is so beautiful because the words are melting, your expression. Because every time when you use this word, your face expression changes, hand expression changes, the body language changes, and the other side melts. They know you are the person. In the English language, they say God fearing. No, no, this is not God fearing. It's not even culture fearing. It is just melting the truth. The only truth. And for the health of the child, other things I can talk, but we have less time, so we just squeeze it into this one. I might continue this topic for another two to three days. Itadakimas goes through some of this. Itadakimas, before you start your food, you say, I'm thankful for, I receive this with thankfulness. Yes. Itadakimas, I receive it. I, when you receive it, you will not receive if you don't like it. But when you're sitting for the food, you receive the first of the God. It is the Kimas. That God is there or not living. And then this one becomes a karma yoga. This becomes meditation. When you sit in meditation and after two minutes, you open your eyes and you see it. The Kimas means you are connecting to the food who made it. The cook, the mother. A father who made that food, the wife, your husband, who made the daughter, who made the food. And you understand that food contains carbohydrates because the person who is keeping the food, the mother who is keeping food, explains on the table daily, this food is our dosa and the dosa is made out of rice which is carbohydrates. It has got dal which is protein, yes, which is good. but. The other things we can uh, mislead to. But expressing is very, very important. So they say, the kimas. Once you finish the food, you, you have to make sure that not a drop is wasted. So after you finish, you look around, you make sure that the plate is clean, not a drop spills outside the plate. If anything is spilled outside the plate, put it back into the plate. Because if you tomorrow, money can spill outside the pocket. Yes. So you practice, you make the child practice and tell him, please put it back into your plate. Cleaning members, the mommy or somebody who is coming, cleaning members coming to polish the floor, not to clean your waste. So we, after that, we say, Gum, if you sit in meditation, then say, Gum, but that could assign means, I'm thankful for the beautiful food I had it. Whether you liked it or not, taste or not, they were prepared it up. And you were able to chew it up and you, you accept. Gambata Kurusa because you trust the people. Ohayo Gosai must Genki Deska for the children. Yes, parenting is very, very important. And you must, I never seen parents telling good morning to the children. Good morning. There, Ohayo Gosai must mean good morning. Good morning. Child say, hi, are you? Ohayo Gosai must. And they bow, they bow. When you bow and the child bow, when you both say Ohayo Gosai must, good morning, namaste. That sound melts to each other. Yin and the yang, negative and positive, melts together, create bilak, a light in the child, in you, in your house. And people who are watching think twice, a devil think twice, a disease think twice to enter into this two relationship of magnetic power. And then you must see, you must see your mother or brother or sister, anybody teacher, Genki Deska, how are you? The child should, you should say, and you should, should prompt the child, Genki Deska, Genki Deska, yes, Genki, you know, how are you, how are you, these are very, very important things. The deep down things, I will explain to you later, on the second part tomorrow. Thank you very much.